Ladies and gentlemen, thanks for watching us. I'm Nils Baranger from the company Chart Guidance, today in partnership with Ducascopy TV. This will be a moment, couple of minutes of pure technical analysis. The subject will be the review, the update of the gold mining, uh, silver and gold mining index, the Philadelphia Gold and Silver Index, XAU index. This is the third update. Um, on the first show, we had a forecast of a bottoming between the third quarter of uh, 2015 until the first quarter of 2016. In the second update, we have uh, concentrated the bottoming between August and November. And this is the new update. So first of all, we have here a quarterly bar chart of the XAU index. We can see that with the new quarterly update on the bar price, we have some kind of improvements on the Bollinger Bands, on the overlying momentum, and something neutral on the underlying momentum, but this is a, a lagging index. We can see that all the previous major declines and rises have been caught by those indicators. On the next slide, which is also a quarterly bar chart of the Philadelphia Gold and Silver Index, we can see that the combination of the RSI and the Arun negative is nailing very precisely the major bottoming. We had three previous ones which have been nailed rather uh, accurately. So there is one that is in the making right now within the current months and quarters. On the next picture, which is now a monthly, a monthly bar chart with the very powerful combination of directional buying pressure, selling pressure and variation, we see that we have the very early stages of the bottoming that need to be confirmed within the next few months. Uh, we can see that all the previous times we had the tops and the bottoms with the combination. On the next picture, which is now back to a quarterly bar chart of the Philadelphia Gold and Silver Mining Index, we have the oscillators and the MACD. We can see that with the recent update on the quarterly bar chart, we have an improvement of some oscillators as well as an uh, angling upwards of the MACD. This is just the beginning. This is really a major bottoming process. This is a multi-months, multi-quarters price action. On the next picture, now also a quarterly bar chart, we have the, the slow stochastic oscillators with a bottoming that has been in the making for a couple of uh, quarters, we are now reaching the extreme low level of that bottoming process and we expect uh, now we need to observe an ongoing price improve within the next few months to few quarters to confirm the reversal. On the next picture, which is now a monthly bar chart, we have the um, we have the, the, um, the momentum, the overlying momentum and underlying momentum. Uh, we have a very significant improve in the overlying momentum on the monthly side as well on, on the underlying momentum. So we are expecting the price to cross the pivotal line within the next few months. So we expect a moderate reversal uh, right now in the making and if we are correct with this assumption, then the first, the first extension will develop into February of 2016, about 60% above the recent low. Finally, the ultimate slide of today's show, this is our timing model. We see that we have an uh, amazing gathering of time projection, not in terms of price, but in terms of time. We have a, a bundle of pro projection, time projections between August and October. So that was our conclusion. There is a 
significant, significant chances that the bottom is in for the gold mining companies. That was our conclusion. Thanks for having following us. Have a good day. That was Nils Baranger from Char Guidance, today in partnership with Ducascopy TV. Thank you. Oh.